guys, it's Kristen with another Chance Resale. Welcome to my channel. I'm a full-time reseller. Today's gonna be a jewelry video. We're gonna finish the jewelry lot from Monday and we are going to open another thread up 15 piece mixed jewelry rescue box. Okay, so if you're new to the channel or just need instructions on how to place an order, here are the instructions right here. I did reprint this, so let me just go over it really quickly. Uh, email me here to place an order. Include these items here. New customers, information needed. Please check the sold list in the comment section before you email me. Refresh the video after watching so you get the most up-to-date sold list. All right, here's my payment information, shipping information, hold information, so I can hold your items for the current week, but you have to pay for your items as you go. You do not have to pay for shipping. I will um, invoice that at the end of the week. And if you do not advise me to hold your items, I will add shipping to your invoice and ship your items. If I was a mind reader, I wouldn't be doing this job. <laughs> so all sales are final, no refunds, exchanges of any kind. Once a video, once a jewelry video has been posted for three days or more, there is no longer any jewelry available. Okay, so let's get into the video and we're going to continue with the jewelry a lot, like I said, from Monday. Um, we do have, it looks like um, a big bag of earrings to start off with, so let's uh, get into that. Wowza. So, okay, let's see. Let's get some mates here. We got these. Ooh, these are KJL. Nice. So these are, let's do a focus check. Are we, do we have a clean screen here? Okay. So KJL clip-ons. These are really nice. Uh, the pad might have to be changed or just removed. And it's a really pretty, um, there's a little bit of schmutz on there. You know, every time I start a video, I, you know, my phone just goes crazy and I'm really not exactly sure why. So let me just mute that. Okay. So, um, here are the, these are glass. They kind of have like an iridescence to them. Very, very pretty. KJL clip-ons. Let's do these for $8. And that is a really good price. Look them up online. Um, let's see, these backs are kind of gross, so I will put new backs on these if anyone buys these. I'm just looking for any maker marks. I don't see any. These are very pretty. Gold tone, they definitely have a nice weight to them. Uh, they're not like cheap feeling with the pink and the green. We'll do those for $4. These, let's find this mate. Um, I don't see you yet. Oh, here it is. All right, so these are gold tone with a little bit of a swirl effect to them. I don't see any maker marks. Four dollars. These look like they have the mate already. All right, these have a lever back. They are also gold tone with like a little medallion in the pink and the green. Uh, there's a little bit of wear on the gold tone, so I'll just do these for $2. I have, let's see, we have these. These are glass, kind of with the AB coating. The ear wires might need to be changed, so let's just do those for a dollar. We have these little cuties. These might be a genuine stone, so let me turn on Pressy and we can check that out. I don't see any markings. So let's move this over and see what the Presidium says. Oh yeah, so these are amethyst, and let's see, um, I'll do those for five. 
Let's see, let's see. We have this guy. Where's your mate? Here we are. So these are gold tone with this really pretty rose in the center. It is transfer wear, but very pretty, very good condition. Again, I will give new backs to these. Um, we'll do five on those, really pretty. I have, these are thin gold tone and black enamel. Nice backs, everything's good, four bucks. Uh, let's see what other mates I can come up with. Oh, we got these right here. These might be rose quartz. Yep. These are rose quartz, super pretty, with the pink heart and the little ball. Um, a little bit of wear on the gold tone hooks, but not bad. I'll do those for five. I see these. These are glass. Let me just see if maybe they're, nope, not amethyst. Glass purple dangles. We'll do those for three dollars. Um, okay, see these. These are pretty. These have a nice long hook, kidney wire, I think they're called, with like the coral color. Well, it's more like an orangey peach, the matte gold tone heart. Really pretty, $4. These definitely look like a stone, a genuine stone. Ooh, these are going up to jade. So we might have some, it's like a yellowish green jade. There is some wear on that silver right there, that silver tone. So I'll just do these for $3. And we have these, these are really cool. These are a matte gold tone, like droplet dangle. These feel very well made. There's no maker mark. And we'll do those for five. We have these really pretty cherub or angel gold tone earrings. No maker mark, I will provide new backs with these and I'll do $4 on those. Um, we have these, these are pretty, again with the matte gold tone. You have the hearts, you have like a frosted white and blue, right, white, oh my gosh, white and green. Okay, very pretty, $4. Um, these are already have a mate. These look very worn. Um, I don't really like the looks of these. So these will just be a dollar. These are green and clear glass with um, a dangle to them. Really pretty. Three dollars. Um, this one I don't see the mate. So we'll put that one on the side for now. Let's look at these. This might be also like a jade. Let me just get these out of here. These little rubbers, rubberies. These are pretty. Might be a quartz. Okay, rose quartz. Really pretty drop earrings. We'll do those for $4. And we have these that are gold tone with some filigree work and some amber colored glass beads. Very pretty, $3. Ooh, these look like Kirk's Folly. They are not marked, but I bet you they are. I don't know if Kirk's Folly marks their jewelry, their earrings, I mean. Really, really cute. So they have the star with the Pave AB stones and then the little cherub holding the 
faceted stone. So I'm gonna do these for $8. Those are really, really, really pretty. We have a cameo. Really nice, really well made, it feels like. Don't see any maker marks. I'll put new backs on. These are really nice as well. I'll do those for five. Here are green glass hook earrings, very pretty, $2. Oh, here's another one like the, those other gold, gold tone little hoops, but these have a pink and blue enamel, very pretty, $4. Um, these, where's this mate? Here it is. These are super pretty, matte gold tone with an acrylic, like green swirl cabochon. Don't see any maker marks, $4. We have these that there's a lot of wear to the wires here. These are glass, but they'll be a dollar. Then we have these little guys, glass, but again, these wires Actually, the wires say 925, so they'll probably just need a polishing. I'll do $4 on those. These look like they have a mark. These are Avon. Really pretty star, gold tone star and rhinestone earrings. There's a little bit of wear right there on the corner, but overall really great, $4. Then we have these pink glass. AB gold tone with kind of like a yellowish stone there. And we'll do those for $3. We have these. How do you, how do these go? Oh, like that. How cute. That is very pretty. So you got the matte gold tone with the pearl, faux pearl. It looks like this might need a little bit of a cleaning. I'm not sure if that's gonna stay on there like that. Um, so I'll just do $2. Then we have these glass, kind of like a striped uh, red and white. We'll do those for $2. And then lastly, we have, I don't know what all this is. Okay, I get it. All right, so you can wear the earring like this, right, with the stone. Gold tone with the X, or you can separate the stone and wear just the X. How cool is that? All right, so for those, we'll do $5. All right, let's dive in for some more. I don't know if you guys are going to get sick of earrings, so maybe we'll save the rest of the earrings for another day. I'm sure I'm sure my videos get fast forwarded enough as it is. <laughs> All right, so this is pretty. This is a purple is it glass? Yes. Glass ring. There is definitely some wear to the back. The gold tone is like completely gone. Um, no markings. It looks like a bigger ring, bigger size. Yeah, this is a 10, but because of the wear, I will just do $4. Looks like we have an earring and necklace set. So first we have the earrings. Now these look like amber. There's a very, very little glow. I'm trying to see if maybe these are also sterling. This feels like maybe um, like it was poured and remade into amber. It does it's not very heavy at all but this does look like sterling to me. I'm 
Okay, we'll probably have to test them. Definitely the earrings, because there's no mark there whatsoever. So let me just grab a couple things. All right. So let's do the earrings. And then we will do the chain. Oops. It's not a very good scratch, so we'll have to see if that'll work. Okay, yes for the earrings, and yes for the chain. I see the little blue chunks in there in the... Uh, scratch it just I didn't get it didn't get the scratch good enough all right so the necklace let's get a measurement nine and a half inches drop on the necklace and I will do the necklace for eighteen dollars and then the earrings if anyone's interested these are really pretty um, I will do, I'll do 18 on the earrings too. So 18 each. Next up we have maybe a Chinese character. Not sure. This looks like ceramic with a long um, cord. We'll just do that for $3. We have silver tone long necklace with this um, acrylic like frosted heart and some jingle jangles <laughs> let me get you a measurement so this one is super duper long the drop on it the total drop including the heart and everything is 24 inches 24 inches drop but with this type of chain you can definitely um you know, clis clap it, oh my God, clasp it anywhere and make it shorter if you would like. So let's do that for five. This is really pretty. This looks like some Jasper and we have some earrings to go with it. I can get them out, okay. So let's look at the earrings. They're very pretty, like earth tones, greens and yellows and grays. Very pretty in the heart shape. We'll do those for $4. And then the necklace has a front toggle with, look at that part right there. How pretty is that? Very, very pretty. I believe it's Jasper. Then you have all these pieces up here. Wow, really, really pretty. So the drop on the necklace is 10 inches and I will do that for $10. Oh, we got another little ring here. So that's glass. Ooh. This is going up to the emerald, really? No way. Let me let me show you. Let me show you. So emerald is the second line from the bottom. Oops, hold on. I think this might be emerald. Emerald and CZ. Oh, there is markings. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, yeah. 925 CL. So this is a uh, Vermeil. So it is 925 sterling with a gold wash. I don't know if that's going to come through clear enough. My stone is still a little moist. Oh yeah, I can see the blue. Oh yeah, very good. 
So we have Emerald Vermeil CZ ring. Let's get the size. Oh, how pretty is that? It's too big for the spinger. I can feel it. So this is a size eight. It is gorgeous and in gorgeous condition. I will do this for $30, three zero. Beautiful, beautiful, darling, I love it. Okay, this is very pretty. This looks like it's sterling. Yep, I can see the 925 right there. And these might be real pearl, yes. And then a beautiful little pearl down the bottom here. Stunning, and I, it looks like we have the matching earrings. So there is an extension on this one, and without it, it's an eight inch drop. So on the necklace, I will do $15. And I do separate pricing because not everybody wants the, the whole set. So um, for the earrings, I will do 10. Super pretty. Pearls are back and they are beautiful. <laughs> All right, here's some more little pieces, little bits and bobs. Here's some watches. Okay. Speaking of pearls, here we go. This is a fish hook clasp. Sometimes there'll be markings on it, so you just want to check that. These are faux pearls. All right. Very nice long necklace, um, but it's in very good condition. The drop on it is 18 inches, and I will do these for $6. This is jade. These are honking pieces of jade. So this has some weight to it and it is adjustable, so it's an adjustable bracelet. Okay, so I will do this one for $8. All right, I see some rings, but let's get some of the other stuff out of the way. This is Futura. Oh, we're missing a stone. I think I have stones that would fit would fit that for a replacement. So, um, because this is in really good condition. So I will change the battery and I'll see if I can find a stone that will fit that. And um, I'll do 12 bucks. And then we have this one. This is, oh, this is from Lexus. What else does it say? Jeez, I can't read that. I have no idea what that says. Jules Jurgensen, maybe? Um, I don't really know anything about this. watch it is not oh i probably should have gave you the length on that one on this one huh all so this one is six and a half six and a half inches and this one i'll also have to try to change the battery this one is seven inches and i don't know do lexus watches do really well I don't know, but I'm gonna just say $15. This is a little brooch, looks handmade. Um, ooh, that might be amethyst in there. It is! A little amethyst cabochon with some nice beadwork. Little brooch, we'll do that for $5. That's pretty, what are you? You are glass. There is no, oh, here it is. There is a clasp right here. It's a long necklace with this really pretty crystal at the end. I should say glass. 
It is a 14 and a half inch drop. But of course, with this chain, you can clasp the clasp anywhere to make it a little shorter. So we'll do that for five dollars. Look at this guy. He looks like a chess piece. It is a pendant and it says one twentieth JMF. Okay, so for this guy, I'll do ten dollars. Here are some more rings. So this one looks like it might just be brass. Oop, that's a little tight there. That's cool. Size six, you can probably make it bigger. It looks like a bypass ring, but as is, I will do $4. Wow, look at this one. This is glass. It's very worn on the band, but it is very pretty. Look at that. And that sits very comfortably on the finger. Wow, I really like that. Um, it almost looks like it could open. Okay, so this one is a size 10. I would stick with 10, it was big on my finger. And I'll do um, $6, that one's awesome. Next we have this one. That one's glass as well. I don't see any maker marks. Okay, it is magnetic, so it's not a precious metal. It is a size eight. Very pretty. We'll do $8. Excellent condition. Ooh, look at this one. These are just glass as well. I don't see any maker marks inside this one. Okay. That is very pretty and it fits very nicely and comfortably on the hand. Excellent, excellent condition. This one's a size eight with the like pink sapphire looking stones and we'll do that one for eight dollars as well all right let's keep going we have just this little bit left to go oh we got one more two more things down in the bag okay so this looks like maybe an agate Possible 925, we'll do $5. This is cool. This is like a Millifiori style, like glass stick pin. $5. <laughs> All right, definitely sterling silver on the findings here. 925 right there. We have a lot of genuine pearls in all different colors, super pretty. It does have an extension. Without it, it's an eight inch drop. And I will do that for $12. Look at this nice chunky Rolo chain. Got something stuck in it, hold on. Okay. So this is a Senorita clasp. I also known as a lifesaver class, but Senorita is the proper name. Ooh, that says something. Ooh, this is a Joan Rivers. Joan Rivers. There's no pendant on here though, so you can of course put a pendant if you would like. Nice big chunky Rolo chain. Um, I'll give you the total length. It's in excellent condition. Joan Rivers makes really, really, really excellent jewelry and can be very collectible. It's 31 inches total length. A lot of her stuff goes for big money. 
I will do this for $12. Oh, I think this is also Joan. Yep, Joan Rivers. This is gold tone with a really pretty egg. Might need a little bit of a cleaning. Super pretty. I bet this could go on eBay for like 40 bucks. I bet. But I'm going to give you guys a good deal. 15 inches on the drop. And we'll do that for $15. Okay. Ooh, this is really pretty. Yep, this is Jade. Gorgeous. Look at that. Nice big heart pendant with the jade all the way up and the gold tone. No clasp. Very beautiful. Nice and cool to keep on you on a hot summer day. It is a 14 inch drop. And let's do that for $14. Gorgeous. Um, I had one of these before and somebody told me that it was a bookmark, um, that you put one side, you know, through, through the book and the other side comes out. Um, do I have a book that I can show you really quick? I, blah, blah, blah. Maybe. Let's see. Okay, so that is awesome. These are all glass. I like the lamp work beads. It says brilliance. So I'll do that for $8. Oh, that's pretty. Is this a stone? Yes, it's cold. Oh yeah. This is actually going up into the quartz line. Nice little pendant. Do that for $5. That says 18 karat gold plated. So white, white gold plated with a really pretty pendant with the dangly stone in there. Super pretty. Let's get a measurement. It is an eight and a half inch drop. Let's do that for $8. That's really, really, really pretty. Oh, look, here's another one of those rings. These, I think, will just be, yeah, glass as well. Really, really nice condition. Again, size 8, so this would make a nice stacker ring. And I will do $8. Here's a flower bracelet. It says 925 China, so let's test it out. Alrighty. Oh yes, we have sterling, and this is a pretty substantial piece. It is not lightweight. You know, oh geez. All right, I'm just dropping it. That's fine. Um, hang on, let me just get that because it had acid on it and I just dropped it on my leg. Okay, so it measures six and a half inches, but it looks like it can go to seven inches. So six and a half to seven inches, and I will do that for 25. We have this bracelet with some hearts. Mm, I don't think this is sterling. No. Let's get a measurement. This one's eight inches. I'll do that for $6. 
We have this one, which is silver tone, maybe sterling. Mm. Oh yeah, sterling. <laughs> So let's check this out really quick. It might have a rhodium plating over it, so it's probably not going to, that's why it's not scratching. So we'll just take the link's word for it because let's see. Oh, um, yeah, the rhodium plating will give it a little bit of a magnetism. So let's just measure. It's an eight and a half inch drop. Um, I'll do, I'll just do 10 on that one. Okay. All right. Here's more pearls. Again, with the 925 findings and the extender, these are so pretty. Look at the colors on these. These are genuine pearls. This is super long, so you can definitely double it. How beautiful is that? Beautiful. The measurement without the extension is a 23 inch drop. 23 inch drop and let's do 15. All right, a couple more pieces and then we will hop into the thread up box. This is very pretty. It does say, what does that say? Where was it? Oh, on the bail. N A N Thai? Yeah, but it doesn't say 925. That's kind of weird. It's not magnetic. The chain is. The chain is marked 925 as well. Let's see. Yeah, it's sterling. I don't know why it didn't say 925. Maybe on the inside of the bale. Okay. Glad I checked it. So sterling little uh, heart pendant. It, it's on a very long chain. The chain is 12 inches on the drop. 12 inches on the drop of the chain. And let's do this one for $15. That's a great price even just for the chain. All right, so we have this one. This is turquoise chips with some pink rice pearls. Really pretty. Mm, I don't really know if this is sterling. It's kind of got some wear to it. And wear and not not um, tarnish. This is 18 inches. 18 inches and we'll do $10. Oh, we got a jack-o'-lantern pin. Little tack pin. We'll do $4 on that one. We have a blue, this feels like glass. Yes, blue glass with some clear rhinestones. And it's then it's like a Figaro chain intertwined with the rope here, a black rope. Not sterling. Eight inch drop on the chain. It does have an extender. Very pretty. Um, $6. This, I can just hear it, it's all glass. Very pretty, look at this. You have all these different shapes, butterfly in there, really cute. It is a seven and a half inch bracelet and I'll do that for $6 as well. Oh, we have an earring, but there's no mate. Maybe it's in the earring bag that we're going to do next time. So I'll just hold on to that. We have a little angel tack pin. That'll be $2. 
Let's see if this what this guy is. This guy is nephrite, and it's a little leaf pendant. We'll do that for four dollars. And lastly is a ring, a ding a ding. All right, let's see. Glass, little faux pearl. There's one teeny little scratch. Boom, right there. A little bit of wear to the back. Um, I don't think this one, yeah. And then the price, I mean the size on this one is also an eight. And I'll do this one for five since it has some wear. Okay, let's get into the Thread Up Jewelry Rescue Box. Um, real quick, reminder, instructions on how to place an order and payment instructions and shipping instructions. Okay, you can just pause that. All that is also down in the description box. Let me just take a sip of water. Ooh, I'm parched. Okay. This one is from Swanee, Georgia. I actually just got another one of these in the mail today. So now I still have three more. No, I'm sorry. Two more of these boxes to open with you guys. So please make sure you're subscribed and you click the bell to all. So you're notified every time I make a new video, especially for the thread up um, unboxings. Okay. Let's open it up and see what we got. So I think my last one on Monday was from Pennsylvania, right? Okay. So this one I ordered on April 24th. Mystery uh, mixed jewelry, 15 piece, uh, $54. Plus shipping or plus tax, I think it is, sorry. All right, so we're gonna reuse the air pillows. We're gonna reuse the paper because reduce, reuse, recycle. Ooh, look at how nice. Let me back you up a little bit. Look how nice they had this in here. Wow. All right, let's move this out of the way. Look at this, how pretty. All right, let's move everything over. And move you guys back in. I'm definitely going to keep these to reuse, 100%. Okay. All right, first thing is J. Crew brand new earrings on the card. So you get two pairs of hoops. You have a larger pair here and then the smaller pair. Uh, no price on here, but like I said, brand spanking new. We'll do um, $10 on these. Ooh, Chico's. All right, so we got some Chico's earrings, also new on the card. Very pretty. I love the dual tone. It's like a um, coppery gold tone with a silver tone. These were 18, marked down to $8.99. I will do them for $6. Put them right back in the bag so they're ready to go to you guys. These look like they might be a Kendra Scott. Ooh, they are. Kendra Scott right there. She always does natural stones in her jewelry and plated metal. So this could be onyx. Very, very pretty, like a gunmetal and black stone. Um, I will do these for $12. Really, really great. Love those. Those can probably fetch about $30 to $40 online. We have, oh, and I shut off the Presidium. Okay, this is absolutely beautiful. Wow. Wow. So what does that say? It looks like I-20. <gasps> stop it. You guys, stop it. 14K. Are they really giving 14K like that? 
you guys. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, so let's bring out Pressy and the gold testing equipment. <laughs> All right, so let's do that. Let's get the 14K lotion, lotion, solution. All right, so these solutions take a little longer, maybe about 30 seconds to verify that it, it is um, real gold. And let's see what you are. Oh, that's kind of disappointing. <laughs> oh, there we go. So maybe a tourmaline, iolite. Hmm. Not very exciting. Oh, those are though, those are diamonds. So you got diamonds on the outside, four of them. And this one, you know what? This could be a tanzanite. It's a little shy of the tanzanite line, but it could be, right? It could be. It's definitely 14K. It held the line really, really, really well. Wow. Okay, so we got diamonds. We got white gold, white gold, 14 gold, carat gold, and possibly tanzanite, maybe? Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section. I just, see, this is going to be hard for me to sell because this fits me. So this is probably a seven, seven and a half. Um, I'm going to have to look this up and I'm going to put a price right here on the screen for you. I'm going to do some research on it and I will offer it to you guys. It is very beautiful though. Okay. All right. Let me put this on the side so I know to... Uh, do some research on it. That was very exciting. So I think uh, Thread Up is starting to step their game up again with their 15 piece boxes, huh? All right, so this one is here's your Senorita clasp with J. Crew. So gold tone. Actually, this one's in pretty good condition. Very, very minimal wear on the clasp. Beautiful, look at this. I love this. I love that bright color, that bright orange in the center. Everything looks to be there. Very minimal wear. So without the extender, it's falling at a 10 and a half inch drop which you can go longer or you can just clasp it here and make it shorter. So let's do um, $10 on that. Ooh, I'm so excited for that ring. This is also something new with tag. This is another Chico's, okay. So this is $45, it is Chico's, it is gold tone. It is a long beaded necklace with these like triangular diamond shape stations. So you can definitely layer this. You can double it. You can probably even triple it because the drop without the extension is 29 inches. So double, triple, layer, and let's do 10 bucks. that back. All right, this one is silver tone. I don't see any maker marks. This is very cool. Very like geometric and abstract. It does have some nice weight to it, so it's not like cheapy feeling or, you know, like uh, the quality seems very good. So this is a nine inch drop and let's do five bucks on that one. All 
All right, let's open the next little packet. Ooh, we have another Kendra Scott. What, what? Let's open that baby up. Let's do it. Kendra Scott, um, I personally, I like the brand and they also um, re can resell very well. So that's why I get excited. Oh, you guys. <laughs> Talk about right up my alley, but this is way too long for me. Um, I like collar necklaces. So here's your Kendra Scott um, dangle, gold, well, it's gold plated. Then you have, it's probably, this is probably dyed howlite. This is, this is gorgeous. Look at that. You might be able to double it with the extender. And the drop on this one is 14 inches without the extender. And I'll do this one for 20. Really, really, really cool. It comes with the bag. Next up, we have the loft. Almost mistook, mis, almost mistook it for a J. Crew. So very pretty. Look at that. Beautiful collar necklace. Gold tone. It's like a matte gold tone. I'm looking at all the rhinestones. I think they're all here. Very nice condition. Without the extender, it is a nine inch drop, so that's 18 inches. Plus you can go longer, so let's do that for $8. Very nice. So far, so really good. I'm happy with this one. Dallas is snoring and uh, growling if you can't hear. <laughs> Oh, this is Pandora, you guys. That's Pandora. A-L-E-925. Look at that. It's gorgeous. Jeez. All right, I can't get in there. Beautiful. I will test it just to make sure. Pandora is also another great jewelry brand to resell. It is sterling. Even their resale values can be very, very good. So we have a sterling and possibly probably CZ Pandora necklace. <clears throat> oh, let's get the length. Eight inches on the drop. It does have an extender. Could go another inch, it looks like. Let's do that for let's do that for 30. Okay, $30. It's in really nice condition, like perfect condition. All right, next little baggie. Ooh, even some garbanzo bags to reuse. Loving it. Loving all the things to reuse. Ooh, what happened here? Is this Pandora too? No way. Wow. Nice. That looks like a really pretty stone. Quartz. Maybe CZ. I have no idea anything about their charm bracelets. Um... Is this like a thing to make to make it smaller? Because it's sitting at only six inches. I 
Let's see. I'm not gonna be able to clasp it myself, but yeah, it's like just barely fitting me and I'm six inches. So this, I wouldn't even say six, I would say like five and three fourths, because you're gonna need some room to, you know, actually clasp it. Wow. And these are sterling, yep. Oh my gosh. All right. Um, I don't know. I'm going to have to do research on this one too and give you guys a price on the screen for you. Well, wow, wow. Okay. Very excited about that one as well. Ooh, look at this one. How pretty is this J. Crew? There you are, right there. Beautiful gold tone. Look at that. It's like a cloudy purple with like a pink sparkle. How pretty is that? The length is seven inches and I will do $10. It's in excellent condition. Okay, we have this, this one might be Stella and Dot. If it's, it's either not marked or Stella and Dot, yep. Knew it, Stella and Dot. I've sold this bracelet before, but in a different color. You got the two tigers, uh, blue and beige enamel, or like a cream color, gold tone, really excellent condition. Seven inches. Super cute. We'll do $8. All right, last bag. I feel like we've done like a million pieces of jewelry. <laughs> Ooh, what is this? So 48 down to 29.99. Wow. This reminds me of like an anthropology tag. So this is all acrylic, very beautiful colors. I love this blue up here. All acrylic, you have the, is it magnet? How do you open it? I don't want to break it. I don't know how to open that. I mean, look how hard I'm pulling. It's giving me dent marks in my fingers and I don't wanna break it, but it only twists a little bit and it definitely doesn't pull out. All right, I'm not gonna mess with it. I don't want to break it. Um, I'll just do $10 on it. Let me give you a drop. Uh, it's 10 inches on the drop, $10. All right, last but not least, bien fight. <laughs> no idea. <gasps> this is pretty. Oh, this is made well. So that was just a bag that they put that in. Oh, it's two. Ooh, a paper clip chain, guys. Paper clip, paper clip. All right, so this one is a matte gold tone by Madewell. It has an extension. It is a plain paper clip chain. If this was regular gold tone, I'd be keeping it, but I don't have anything to match with matte. So it's 11 inches with a three inch extender. So 11 inch drop and then add three inches if you would like. Excellent condition. We'll do that one for 10. And then this one is a cute little, just like a layering chain box chain with the little balls on it, gold tone, still the mat again. It's just a little twisted. Um, this one also has an extension. So it's seven and a half inches on the drop and then you have the three inch extender again. So we'll do this one for $6. All right, so let's see, that's, are we counting that as one? So one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 
11, 12, 13, and then the two pieces that I have to look up are 14, 15, the Pandora bracelet, and the 14 karat gold ring. Yay! Okay, so that was a really good box, you guys. Let me know down in the comments what your thoughts are on the box and maybe what your favorite piece was. Give me a thumbs up if you haven't already. Subscribe right down here. It's free. Thank you for watching, and we will see you in the next one.